Like, uh, Ate likes to put a little Nutella in there. Got some whipped cream. And you make it to your own taste. Sit down and enjoy. <music> making crepes in the morning so today I'm gonna go ahead and get the strawberries ready and then put them in the refrigerator and they'll be nice and juicy for tomorrow morning I'm just gonna give you a heads up of what's what's, uh, what's going on here uh, so we look down this way I got my strawberries in the sink well I'm gonna core them I don't know if that's the actual name actual word for it but I'm gonna core them take the stems out slice them up you listen to the cat in the background and I'm gonna put them in my bowl over here I got some sugar that I'm going to use here to sweeten them up just a little bit. And once they sit overnight, they'll get nice and juicy and be ready. We're going to make crepes in the morning. Everybody loves my crepes. <laughs> so first thing I got over here is we're going to wash them off and cut them up. Oh, let's see if we can do this in a simple fashion. First thing I do is just core them out. You know, where's the camera on this thing? Just core them out. Wash them up a little bit. Quarter them. Put them in the bowl. So, uh, move it out this way a little bit so you can see it. A little bit of wetness there, not much. I'll probably stir it up a little bit too just to make sure that sugar gets all the way all over everything. Squish it down a little bit, but you know, a, little, a little bit juice flowing. It should be okay. So we'll show you first thing in the morning, it looks like. I mean, I'll say first thing in the morning, it's only going to be about five hours away from now. Ah, good thing it went in the sink. All right, guys, did a little more stirring.
for it. I'm going to take it over here and put it in the refrigerator somewhere. Hey everybody, I'm back. Today we're going to make the, uh, this morning we're going to make the, the actual crepe wrappers. The recipe called for two eggs, two cups, or not two cups, two tables, tablespoons of uh, butter, melted butter, some milk, water, flour, and a little bit of vanilla. I didn't get the vanilla out yet, did I? There's the picture. And we're going to mix it all together, get a nice, nice uh, consistency where it flows a little bit, but it's not, you know, uh, real, real thin. So, first thing I'm going to do, I think it was one cup. Yeah, one cup. But since I'm going to actually one and a half this recipe, I'm going to put uh, one and a half cups of flour in here. One. This is a quarter cup scoop, so I gotta put six of these things in here. I just use this dry scoop uh, thing. That's three. Because uh, it makes it easier when I got I, everything else. Uh, it makes it easier when I got to do the water, the milk. I just and I don't like to get everything dirty. Okay, then we need uh, three fourths cups of water. I'll just use this again. One, two, three. Melt my butter. I can melt my butter. Three fourths cups of milk. Almost two. Okay. Oh. This is a little bit thinner milk. Probably need to put a little water in here. A little thicker milk, if you will. Okay. The butter's almost melted. Second. Two eggs. Take two eggs, but since I've had one and a half pounds, I got three eggs out. Butter's melted, there we go. Get all. Okay. Whisk out. Just beat it up until it gets nice and smooth. It should be a, a nice, uh, maybe like a thick syrup uh, consistency. Cause it's gonna, you're gonna run it around the pan when you uh, put it in here. Then I got a little bit of uh, vanilla here. Put a little vanilla in there. Never mind. Go around it down a little bit. Clean this up. And for this part, I get out a 
one third cup each. No. All right, then usually for the first crate, I'll put a little bit of uh, cooking spray in the pan. Just a little bit, it doesn't take much. This, well, this pan's here, that doesn't stick real well, uh, real bad, which I should say to the uh, pan. So I just usually coat the first one. Feels kind of hot. Take the first one, take a full scoop. Just dump it in the middle. Now pick up the pan. I roll the roll the pan around. Get that mixture. So run around the pan. I used to cook it until the edges start to curl up a little bit, like this right here. See how the edges are curling up? Then I'll uh, take it, flip it on over. Just cook it on the set on the back side here for just uh, about a minute or so. Get all that uh, heat up. Okay, hold on to it. Now that that's done, I just put it over here. And I will continue doing that until the batter's all done. Okay. Now that everything is prepared, got it all set mm -hmm. on the table, everybody can pick their own filling they want to put in. Strawberry, Nutella, whatever they want to do. Got a little strawberry filling there. Like, uh, Ate likes to put a little Nutella in there. Got some whipped cream. And you make it to your own taste. Sit down and enjoy. Okay, thanks for watching. Remember to hit that like button. Uh, hit the bell. Subscribe. Thank you for everything. We really appreciate your, your uh, joining us. And thank you very much. Bye-bye. Salamat sa panonood. Show us some love and hit that subscribe button. And please like this video. Check out our other videos and join us as we journey for life. Have a wonderful day.